Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. Baby, we are back in the saddle. We are ready for action. And I hope you're having an absolutely fantastic day wherever you are at. You guys make my days better and hopefully I can repay the favor even a little bit by helping make your day a little bit better as well. Uh, if you're watching this in real time, I took a little bit of a break, a little bit of a hiatus from recording, producing content, things like that, because my real life decided to kick it into overdrive, which, you know, as adulting goes, it happens every once in a while, and content creation truly is my happy space. I like to come to my computer, open my game, clear my head of all worries, and just hang out with you guys and have a good time and be like 100% authentically there for you all and when there's a lot of things going on in behind the scenes and in the background i don't feel like i can fully do that so taking that time was really crucial to me um there were rumors about me getting deployed really soon for like six months so hopefully knock on wood that's been deterred a bit and then uh grad school started back up because it is fall it is fall in real time here so spooky season we got our pumpkin up um and yeah, that means classes are back in session. I'm almost done with my master's degree. So thank you all immensely for all your support on this channel, this passion project of mine. I love doing this, but sometimes it's good to just take a breather on the weekends and literally do nothing, but maybe go outside, touch some grass and watch anime on your couch for eight hours. So that's exactly what I did. I'm ready. I'm rejuvenated. I'm ready to probably accidentally punch my horse and roll down mountains over and over again. I've read your comments. I appreciate you guys' uh, feedback. I'm not really big into the backseat gaming thing, but I do think that some of it can be helpful considering this game is so massive. So like I did decide to look into little things like helping with chores around the camp and refilling the deposits of the camp because that was honestly starting to piss me off. I was like, I'm spending all of my time in this game, getting a haircut, taking a bath and figuring out how the fuck to supply the camp because I don't want people to hate me. So I say that as I accidentally just like, well, accidentally like shoot people going down the street. But nonetheless, I digress. I do want to get better at this game. Contrary to what my videos may suggest, I do actually want to make improvements. And I think that it might be worth listening to some of the comments that are genuinely there to try to help me. But I don't like when people tell me how to play the game because I feel like that's boring. So <laughs> that's where I'm at. Hopefully you guys are doing well wherever you're at. I've got my coffee. I'm ready for chaos. I hope you are too. And without further ado, let's get into it. All right. We're back in the saddle. We're looking a little bit crusty. We've been asleep for a few weeks. A little dirty. Howdy. But uh, it's a beautiful day. Hello. Hello. It's all nice and misty outside. Everyone's hustling and bustling. Always good to see. Very nice. All right. So first things first, I got a couple object objectives I want to accomplish today. I say that every time I play. However, I do want to make an honest effort to get better at the camp stuff in this game. I want my people to be happy. So, that being said. I want to figure out how to do chores, and rather than just wandering around aimlessly hoping I'll figure it out somehow, I'm going to Google it like a real gamer does. So, how to chop wood. Chores in Red Dead Redemption 2 come in a variety of different forms, though none of them... Oh! Yes. Yes, I did. I never liked her. I know, you already... Ideas above her station. Above anyone's station. That Susan coming in with the facts here, dude. We don't like Mary either. She made us do shit for her and then she didn't even give us a smooch, which I mean in the gentleman's book. Sometimes you can just, you know, believe it or not, do nice things for a lady. Whoa. Do nice things for a lady and not expect a smooch in return. But nonetheless, she was bamboozling us. She was like giving us a little bit of an inch like, hey, I'm back in town. Ha ha ha. Also, can you help my brother and make him not end his life? What the fuck is that, Mary? Anyways, Susan's got the right idea. Hello, Dutch. How do I chop wood? Look for a little black circle marker on your map that corresponds with an axe and a tree stump next to a bunch of wooden logs. Okay. Looking at mini a map. This is ammo. Little black circle marker. 
butcher ammunition do i not have it unlocked yet eh eh uh uh <laughs> huh okay we'll move on how to carry sacks and hay a little black dot on your map right by the wagons on the east side of your camp more than likely head over to them hmm maybe i just don't have sacks unlocked maybe i just don't have chores unlocked yet I hear Mary's been seen again. God dang it. Well, I always thought, well, she seems real nice. Of course you do, Abigail. She had better ideas than me. She's the only one. <sighs> hmm. All right. Well, I'm going to shave. I'm looking a little, uh, scraggly. Ooh. Why is my chin look? There we go. I'm trying to grow that mustache out. Pomade our hair a little bit. A little bit off the top. There we go. Make some beans. Still reading. I've taken a break. But yes, I plan to keep reading. This is uh oh, we have some new outfits. Or I never just scrolled down. It's the reason we're living. Oh, yeehaw. They're talking about the real truth. Why do you like reading books? Well, the only thing that makes you happy is uh, being in a place somewhere else. Well, I could. If I chose to. I just not to. Maybe one of us will teach you. Huh. Okay. So that's settled. Um, I don't think I can do chores yet. Because I even went out of my way to Google it, and I see no little black dots, so... Evening. Howdy. Evening. So that being said, I'm now gonna... Hunt a little bit. Maybe try to... Oh, that's a rabbit. Come here. Jesus, that was a little bit morbid for killing a rabbit. Let's do a test. Pick up this guy. Whoa! Whoa! Did I have to skin it? I just wanted to pick it up. God damn it. Well. Because I think that I have to bring the entire animal unskinned to the camp in order to supply the stew. God damn, this game is beautiful! Succubus western game. Alright, let's try to... get a little some some. Go for a little evening hunt. Jesus Christ. Well. That was something. Okay. Pick up. I'm gonna... Cooking a carry animal will only reward you with meat. Okay. 
That's fine. So experiment done. We have a skinned rabbit and an unskinned deer. Let's take this back to camp and see what the results yield. Because I feel like I just keep donating chunks of meat to the stew pot. And the stew keeps coming. He keeps cooking it. So maybe that indicates I'm doing something right. Whoa! Bill, it's me! You filthy animal, it's always me. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so it's showing red on ammunition and food. Okay, princess, right in the fire. Do I need to remove the deer? Can I just drop it? Okay. We're experimenting. God, the way that you can just, like, kill animals, though, is so gnarly. I just walked up to that rabbit, held it up, and was like, skinned the entire thing. That's brutal, bro. Brutal. Um. Hello, Abigail. Pearson's but butcher counter. That's what I was trying to do. What you mean, brother? All right, so I have to walk all the way over there again. At least these lights are beautiful. Look at this ambience. Can we just take a second? Look at this blue, misty mountain glow with the ambience of all the little lanterns. And oh, man, something that just feels so alive about nighttime. You guys... Feed us for heck yeah, brother. Uh, you guys relate to that? You guys feel alive in the nighttime? Or are you more daytime birds? Boom. Donate. We're gonna run out of meat here soon if we're not careful. Good. We really needed this. Okay. Was that it? Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. So I didn't have to carry it. In advance for this stew. It needs better meat. Thank you, Arthur. Dang. Okay. Like waves on the bay of Bisky, I began to tumble and roar. Oh my god, I love this game. My face is red like a lobster. I fell and broke my poor lobster. <laughs> And can I, like, craft at this? So I did a little bit of Googling about crafting stuff, and I want... So I want to donate more. I want to do chores whenever they're available, because it looks like they're not, potentially, or I'm just doing something wrong. And then I also want to try to craft for the camp, because I think the way that you increase the ammo, potentially, is by... Yeah, okay. Crafting and cooking. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Also cartridges and stuff. Hi, Jinky! Hi, little baby! Okay. Hop! Uh, sure. We're experimenting. There we go. Um... I do need to buy some more horse reviver, I think. I don't remember how much I have, but Lord knows I'm going to need more. Let's take a gander and see if I can even check here. Maybe I need to be on the horse to see what goods I've got. Probably. Okay. So we craft some ammunition. I just uh, need to keep that in the back of my mind. Any time we go to the store, I need to get some more horse reviver whenever we go into town, because good news, I'm going to need a bath soon. Um, and here's the ammo 
thing. Oh, Arthur, it is good to see you. Yeah. Okay, maybe? Just great, but I nearly got killed back in town. Oh, Lord. They caught me robbing from a store and I ran for my life. You weren't followed here. Arthur Morgan, of course not. Who do you think you're speaking to? Good girl. Whoa. My, my. for gold and land and oil and freedom so i spent a couple of years at sea but it's not what i imagined without the hunt it's not really anything i don't want to simply carry things across the sea i want to pull things from it so i too go west and soon i fall into some terrible trouble with some really bad men i meet they forced me to marry a woman so they could steal all my money. But then Dutch finds me very much at my wit's end. And you boys know the rest of that story. Hmm. Some now, lore. I'm a ship's cook for a camp with no ship. <laughs> with no ship. That's awesome. <laughs> but I miss the sea. I do. It calms you somehow. Man's only true love is the sea. Or something like that. Alright, let's go, um... Hi. Hi. So I've got ammo. I want to try to sleep and then in the morning potentially try to donate it, maybe? And then... In the morning we can go... Take a bath and then go do some missions! Eat some food, maybe? We're looking a little bit skinny. We're looking a little bit scraggly. I also heard that there's, uh... A way, if you don't- if you eat a lot of food and... Never shave, you can just, like, grow a big fat beard and quite literally be big and fat. <laughs> Which is an interesting... Playthrough. I kind of like that. That's fun. You can just... Eat a lot of food, live your fat and happy life, just vibe, you know? Go to the bar, have food every day, never shave. As for many, I hope I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. A loves it. Aww. Good morning. Oh, we found the O'Driscoll's hideout, but no sign of comb. Well, so long as we're hitting them before they hit us. Oh, and that Karen? Not so good. How to donate right ammo and medicine for camp. You don't donate those items. When you unlock the ledger at your camp, you can use camp funds to restock the various items. Via campfire, you place outside of your camp and donate it to the camp. Oh, so I go to the ledger. Okay. So I go to this little guy. Good morning, Arthur. Hello. Open this little guy. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? Oh. So I need these to, like, improve the actual thingy, my bob. The actual camp. What about, like, donating individual ammunition? Give item. Okay. Uh. Just random valuables? I mean, that's kind of fun, I guess. Instead of selling them to the stores. Okay. I don't know. We're just red on... Morning, Mr. Morgan. Hello. May okay, so I think maybe I did upgrade 
now that I'm thinking back to my previous episodes, I think I did upgrade the medicine truck. We can look back at the ledger again. I did just look at it, but I think I upgraded the medicine cart, which is why it's showing as, let me show you guys here in the top right, if you look up there. We're also broke, don't look at my money. Okay, I might have bought a lot of, uh, eh, gun customizations that looked really pretty. Nonetheless, we got white on medicine, red on ammunition, and red on food, so. That's what I like to hear. Yeah, because I upgraded the basics and sharpened the senses, so it looks like if I go and upgrade the offense, maybe that's what'll do it for me. Restock. Okay, so I did a restock. Okay, now it's yellow. Okay, okay, okay. And then for food... I just need to donate more food, maybe? Restock food? Hmm, it's not letting me restock the provisions on the food wagon. Less bland. Quantity and- Oh! Oh! So I use- so I've been donating money to the- Yay! So I've been donating money to the book. So that's why it was almost at $200, but that money is just sitting there like an allowance that I get to spend on what we upgrade in the camp. That's really cool. Okay, so now that's why we're at white with the food and then yellow with ammunition and yellow with medicine. Oh, we have 134 doll hairs now. Okay, that's really cool. So I can upgrade the medicine and food one more time. We've got 134 doll hairs, ammunition, lodging. What is this? Dutch wants something comfier. Well, fuck Dunch. Dutch, first of all. Second of all, okay, great to have more room to hitch. Horse station, man, that's like a luxury. Chicken coop, some local farms are selling off old coops. That would be a neat upgrade. And then making extra gear, that would be cool as well. So those are like long-term goals. We can trick out our basic necessities now. And then I think I'm going to max out, well, max out to their greatest extent. I'm going to do this tonic thing. Woo! This is so much fun! Okay, 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 okay. Look at that! Oh, fuck! Now there's a next level? Alright, whatever. Nonetheless, now we're gonna do this guy. Get some real chewing tobacco. Yay! Okay, 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 okay. And then next, we'll get, we'll get the leatherworking tools, maybe. Cocaine chewing gum? Oh, hell yeah, brother. Yeah, okay. So, yellow for medicine and ammo. I was sitting over there crafting bullets by the fire, like, why the fuck isn't this working? This makes so much more sense. Okay. Look at that. See? So, how are ya? Boom, baby. Good for you. How are ya? Good for you. Alright, that's the spirit. Dude, look at that. Making moves. We are making moves, everybody. Cool, 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 cool. We're gonna have a bowl of stew if there's some available because I'm gonna mooch off the camp. All right, God damn it! I put my foot down and we put money into this place, so I'm gonna have my bowl of stew and eat it too. And if I want, I'm having seconds. Morgan. You seem chipper. But where there's life, Curly, being prepared. Check again after noon. All right, this is a good opportunity. Wait, 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 is that a black dot on the map? <gasps> wait. What is this? Sacre bleu. A sack? We pick it up and put it somewhere else. Oh, shit. Good morning. You know, dude. So all the people in the comments that were talking shit and they were like, you need to be doing chores around the camp. You're a bad person. People are going to start noticing that you're not carrying your weight. Bitches, I didn't even have that shit unlocked. I didn't even have that shit unlocked. Everyone who was 
dumping on me for not doing my chores. I didn't even have those shits unlocked. I am so slow at playing this game. I didn't even fucking have ch chores unlocked. And definitely not wiser. So everyone who was being mean to me, saying I am not a contributing member of society, you're right, but I didn't have the choice. So suck my toe. Anyways. Sorry, I had to get that off my chest. What is this? Bucket? It's for the horses? Wash bin? Where is that at? We have a wash bin in the camp? You're telling me I could have been taking baths? In the camp and I don't have to check into a hotel every time I want to wash myself? Hey. What up? Where's the... Excuse me. Uh... I don't think I can wash myself, but... Efforts are being made. That doesn't look like a bath. Morning, Uncle Arthur. Hello. Child. Oh, and we can chop wood. Look at this. S tier gameplay right here. Can we do this shirtless? I'm just asking for a friend. But actually, though. <laughs> At some point, I think when I was playing The Witcher, I just took his clothes off and we were just frolicking in the forest. <laughs> Nakey. People came in and they were like, why is Geralt not wearing clothes? And I was like, mind your business. <laughs> Personal reasons. Hell yeah, brother, look at us. We dropped off our sacks, dropped off our water, chopped some wood, look at that. Contributing members of society. Oh, there's one more sack that we need to unpack. Before we take off Arthur's shirt and look at his back. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I had to finish the ride. <laughs> no, Arthur. It's the illness of romantic. Oh, Dutch is onto something. What? Hope. <laughs> The illness of romantics. What is hope? Hope is. Oh my god. Those heavy enough for you? All right. Daily chores are done. I'm ready to be on my merry way. Hi. Oh, is the what in time is it? 8.37. All right, not anywhere near noon, so the stew's still cooking. Let's go, um, let's go do some stuff. You guys want to do a mission? Because I want to do a mission. I also looked into some stuff, and fast traveling's a thing, apparently. I'm not, like, looking way ahead, just so you guys know. Oh my god, that just took off in a sprint. Um, I still don't like backseat gaming and all that jazz, but... Um, I am trying to get better at the game, so like doing things like chores and then discovering ways I can be a little bit more efficient because I feel like I'm spending all my time falling off my horse and off of mountains. So with that being said, um, there is 
fast travel in this game, and I think I'm kind of close to unlocking it. I just need to do some missions or something, so I'm just gonna keep playing the game naturally, and I'm sure it'll uh, happen. But with that being said, let's take a gander. So we got the treasure hunter thing, we got the dino bones, dream catchers, okay, the pipe, that'll happen naturally. All of these are gonna kind of happen as we go. Crime novels, okay. The biographer, okay, these are all like side tasks, eh? Challenges. I think I need to take a gander at the map. Okay. Let's, uh, ooh, crime. So these guys are for like the side story so we can write the biographies. Let's get Micah out of jail. I think that'll buy us just enough time. Just uh, help him get out of jail by noon so we can have some stew <laughs> fresh off the pot, you know what I'm saying? It's uh, all in a day's work. I also feel like we need to feed our horse. She's looking a little thin. Here, princess. Can I get you some food? You want some oat cakes? Carrot. There you go. Get her nice and fat. One more. Mad girl. Let's give her a brush, too, before we head on. Out. And we gotta go! We gotta bounce, dude! We gotta help this guy out so we can be back by noon. I'm on a tight schedule. We got shit to do! Ooh, we can hunt on the way back, too. That's a lot of deer near the house. Shaping up to be a good day, boys. Hello, horsies! Oh yeah, we got a lot of recommendations for the river name, so as you guys may recall, I was throwing every single dead body in this river. Um... Oh, shit! Do I get him out? Do I get him out? What's going on here? He's a fugitive! Do I help this fugitive? Ooh, I don't want trouble. I said leave. Now get going. Eh, fuck it. what the hell you're in here for? Who are you? Shoots the lock, accidentally kills him. Put your gun away, Arthur. Who's this guy? I don't have no money to give you, but I do have some information that might interest a man like yourself. What, someone who frees fugitives? lady who collects things. Has a place uh, north of Strawberry. All kinds of goodies out here. <laughs> Might be something there for you. <laughs> Interesting. Well, thanks again. <laughs> Safe travel. Home robbery. Yeah. You too. Lay low. Uh, okay, so we just got a tip on a lady we can rob. I'm about to get lower honor for robbing these guys, aren't I? No. Ah, fuck. Okay. Okay. What? I climbed on this guy's head and fell off onto his horse. Honey, I swear, I don't know how it happened. I just fell onto her. Alright, I don't even want to rob that other guy, because I don't want to lower my honor. I'm an honorable man, okay? 
Y'all just stay put, you hear? Okay, anyways. Let's, uh... Let's keep on keeping on this way, buddy. Maybe we'll commit crimes later. Oh, yep, you better turn around, brother. Okay, let's get our buddy out of jail. Eat some noon stew, and then uh, rob an innocent lady. Probably a witch who collects things like trinkets. Sounds like a grave hag. Fuck, I love The Witcher. Talking about it like 10 minutes ago made me really reminisce. I loved that game. I want to replay it someday. So good. Where are we? Post office? Oh, it's like a little station. Okay. We're going up there. Where is the Strawberry Fields Forever place he was talking about? That's a horse. Strawberry. Strawberry something. He said north of something. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Was it that? Trapper? No. God, this map thing is so heckin' cool. I would love to get one framed behind me when we finish the game. Hmm. All right, stay tuned. We'll find it eventually. Do 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 was a wise man. Do 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 do. Stranger? Good morning. Oh. Hello. Why the day, isn't it? Sure. What a country. I'm working on a project. Photography. Yeah, I guess that bit. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Wildlife. That's my thing. Or that's what I want to be my thing. If I have to take another picture. Of a grumpy house frau or pompous middle class burger, I will feed myself to the lions. Stand here. <laughs> Me? Here? Just there. Albert Mason. Arthur Morgan. Pleasure. I'm trying to find and capture images of our great predators before our greatest predators kill them all and stick them on some clubhouse wall. Me? Yes. Not the easiest, but, well, I love a challenge. The trick is to leave a big load of meat. Whoa! Relax and pray they don't mistake me for lunch. Oh, good heavens. My bag, that thing is robbing Oh, my oh, God. Heavens. Don't worry. That thing is a coyote. Uh, Take you one, too. Coyote. Wildlife photographer. <laughs> Get that coyote! Okay. 
Can I just wrestle it? Loki! Jesus! All because this guy sucks. This is what I'd call a robbery gone wrong, coyote. God damn it. Can I just take the bag? What's in the bag? Do I want to return it? Alright. Carly did nothing wrong. We should kill the guy for being bad at his job. That's just me. What do you guys think? Be better at your job. This is a big bag of meat. Well, well. Got the <sighs> bag. Oh, thank you. Thank you, sir. Bag full of meat will tend to bring out the worst in the local population. You are a gentleman. The bag also had a lot of my supplies. You've saved me days. I'm can't thank you enough. I'm I'm thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm uh, you take care, sir. What? I ain't the one trying to get myself eaten. I realize I am a fool. <laughs> Forgive me. And thank you very much once again. Please, fun to attract any wildlife, huh? Need some privacy. Shut up. <laughs> Anyways, uh, okay. All in a day's work, now what? I need some privacy. That guy sucks, he didn't even give us any money. Yeah. I mean, I get I can be a good Samaritan and all and just do things out of the kindness of my heart, but what's the fun in that? I'm broke! Oh. Well, that was fast. We haven't even made it 30 seconds. Sir, please stop. Oh, I beg you. Where? Oh, Whoa! Bad swords here. I took a little jolt and have managed to get myself hopelessly lost. I am staying in Strawberry. If you could just guide me back. Sure, that's where I can rob that lady. You have a good reason to say no. Oh, thank you, thank you, sir. Well, after you, what possessed me to come out here, I'll never know. What? Is this guy gonna try to rob me? Do I need to take him on my horse? What are you doing out here anyway? This clearly ain't your natural habitat. I, no, I'm just visiting. I, I, I'm from New York City, actually. You don't say. Oh, yes. There was some talk at the country club about this burgeoning little resort town called Strawberry. Resort so town? it might be quite the trip to see what all the fuss was. Perhaps make a few investments while it was still undervalued. Turns out I was made the fool. Not enjoying it, Dan? It's a town of splinters. If you could call it much of a town at all. all right. I'd hardly stepped off the carriage and I'd taken in the whole place. Huh. So they I described it. Some might call it charming. Yeah, like a bustling town, well, but it's. Tell you, charm is not worth much these days. You AKA... show me a timber frame shack, and I'll show you Broadway. Yeah, like a AKA most southern charm. Meanwhile, you have this towns. Mayor, a quite intolerable blowhard. <laughs> a little spoke woodwork, and he thinks this is a cultural hub. The man's completely deluded. Well, I should give him some credit. Oh my God, so many people. Salesman, he did get me out here after all. More fool me. Now I'm tromping through the leaves in the muck with some cowboy. No, no offense. <laughs> Little taken. Like some cowboy, God, imagine. Oi, bruv, come here. I mean, that's like being like, oh, I'm from New York. I came here to see the oh, yes. sights of the this South. Let's go to Birmingham, Alabama. No offense. Insert southern city here. <laughs> All right, and we're making sure our guy's following us. I cannot possibly follow you at 
<laughs> I was waiting for it. Oh, are we close to town? Uh, sorry for stonewalling you, buddy. It looks like I quite literally can't answer, and I don't actually know. I've never been here myself. You're you welcome. Seem quite the resourceful sort, sir. If for some reason you plan to spend any time in Strawberry, you may want to look into that gabbing mayor. Something is definitely off with him. Oh, a mystery? Off. All right. I'll keep that in mind. Hey, mister. Off with him. Oh, I love these flowers. Off with him. Well, this is a nice little place. Just what is your problem? Nothing. Off with the mayor, eh? Mayor, look at he's building up through winter. And don't think it's no other than one of his prospects. Damn fool's got rags for brains. This is how it is. You're saying the mayor has rags for brains. Ooh. All right. Interesting. I love listening to the goss, the hot, juicy goss from town. All right. What do we got here? Is this where our boy's at? We're here to rescue Micah, yep. our local idiot. Hello, sir. I've, uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang. Oh, that was a good stretch. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mix, so maybe them's your boys. <laughs> you can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, Sheriff. What? And it's pouring. Let what? Here, you Do I have to break him out? God damn it. You think these bars can hold me? You hear me? No, no, God we're damn it, take that son of a bitch. Oh. Fuck! Alright, well. Dude. I don't know how this was supposed to go. Grab the cell keys. I don't think this is supposed to go like this. You hurry. There'll be more law here any minute. God damn it. Hurry up! Was I supposed to, like, get them to sneak out or something? Like, was I supposed to, like, lure the sheriffs out? Somehow, and then break them free? Come on! Thank you, friend. God damn it! Hurry up! Come on! Give me a gun. Let's go! Hey, you. Oh. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Come on! I'll tell you later. Come on! Fuck! Follow me, Arthur. God damn it! I'm looting! God fucking damn it! That's a horse. Come on, fuck! God! Don't go that way. Let's get the hell out of here. Where are we going? We're shooting up this whole town! Finally lost your damn mind. God damn maniac! I should ah. We're in it now, Morgan! What do you want to do? Oh my god! I still don't think this is the way this was supposed to go. God! I'll kill this whole town if I have to! 
G Micah, where are we going? What is the plan? Go, go, go! We should be long gone by now. They got something of mine. I ain't leaving without. Oh, we're so fucked. Oh my. Jesus. Really should get out of here. Oh my god. Like I said, I need to see someone. Skinny! Get out here! Is this part of the thing? Was I supposed to do this? I am screwed on a moral level in so many ways. I just wanted to be a good guy. I was trying to break him out of jail. You always was a letdown, you fat sack of crap. Oh my god. Excuse me, man at Arthur. We just shot up this whole town. Hello, Maddie. Oh my god. This wasn't this like a resort village? My guns. Oh my god, all these guys are missing their brains. Well, look at all the dead bodies in the mini map. Oh my god. Well, no witnesses. Time to drop all these bodies in the river. Come here. Come on. Atta boy. Well, that was a failure. And to the next. Alrighty. Just gonna clean this town right up here. Nothing ever happened. We're just gonna wee. Just gonna send him on his merry way. And this guy. And then we're just gonna. Whoops. Yep, that's good. That'll get him off. Okay, bye bye. I showed him. And I'll show the rest of this. Micah, you son of a bitch. God damn it. I'm just gonna let him. I'm trying to get rid of our evidence, Micah, you fool. God damn it. Jesus Christ. This is why we can't have nice things. Did I just kill Micah? Whoops. There's different ways to play this game, and I just happen to be a murder hobo. Checkpoint. <sighs> All right. Oh, look, all the bodies are gone. The mess was cleaned up for us. You have really lost it this time. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. We are murderizing this whole damn town. You wanna get out of here, don't you? Jesus Christ. I wanted to rob that little old lady first. It's time we got out of here, God damn it. No witnesses. God damn it. Okay, we're going now. Boom, baby, let's go! Woo! We're doing crime and not doing any time. Get out of the red, get out of the red, get out of the red. Oh, shit! Boom, baby, let's go! <laughs> Shit! We're 
we going, Micah? Come on, lead the way. Let's get out of here before we get any more on our tail. The law is searching. Oh, fuck. There was some good shooting, Morgan. Whew. I gotta hand it to you. What the hell God was that you it. pulled back there? Gotta be wild, all right. Wild? Making a house call in the middle of all that? Ain't much I care about more than those guns. That much is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. Oh my gosh, it's so dark. I saw how it goddamn ended. Oh my god, the lightning! What? That's a first. I was looking for the lantern. Do I have a lantern? Did I lose my lantern? Whatever. He was gonna let Jesus. Me I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny, too. If he hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely. I promise. Oh my gosh. Uh, well, your lucky Dutch has got your back. Someone. Dude, this is insane. They perfectly encapsulated the yellow before the storm. I don't know if y'all have ever been in a lightning storm, but like how it's just eerie and yellow outside before a tornado or whatever. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. Oh? Thank you. There I was having a dull day only for you to liven it up by letting me help you shoot up half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. Why you act all sour all the yeah, time? Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court just right, Damn! Sorry, brr, 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 brr. <laughs> Arthur, you and me, sons of Dutch, makes us brothers. Sometimes, brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back a strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. Hell yeah. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offer. That's fair <laughs> enough. That's fair enough. He has been in some shit, huh? I know. Yeah. Oh man, that was a fun little thing, huh? Offhand holster allows you to carry two sidearms at once and dual wield them. Hell yeah. Bow, bow, bow. What time is it? In game. A hundred eighty dollar bounty. Fuck me, dude. It's four p.m. and I missed my stew. Oh man. Oh Jesus Christ. What have we done? <laughs> Jinx. I know. Additional lawmen are patrolling while a town is locked down, and you will become wanted again if spotted before clearing your bounty. We have a hundred eighty dollar bounty to pay. Y'all. Oh. My god. Can I... Just travel back to camp somehow? This is such a mess. I need to sell all of my stuff. That's probably the quickest way to... Make some money. Just like selling all my pocket watches and stuff, but I don't know where to do that because you can't do it at the general store. I need to sell all my valuables somehow. Hmm. Cause I'm like, I'm like $50 deep into this $180 bounty, which is like a million dollars. I mean, this isn't that bad. I'm just crossing over a little bit of a patrol area. Mm. Heck, man. I need to sell stuff. People in the comments were talking about something called the fence. Which is like an illegal smuggling place, which I feel like is um, probably a good place to start. But I don't know if I have that unlocked. Unlocked. 
and or how to get that. Is that a patrol? Oh, dear God. And or how to get that unlocked. I'm skilled. Oh, God. Looks like we're gonna have to be running from the law for a little while. And I might have to wait on robbing that lady because I don't think I'm gonna get into Strawberry uh, anytime soon without hassle. So. Well, if it isn't the consequences of my own actions. It's, uh, ooh. Wait. What was that? Bada bing, bada boom. I don't know if this was, uh... Good. Yeah, they're very poor condition, but I don't know. I'm gonna bring some food back to camp since I was gone. We're gonna have to get creative with the way we make money. <laughs> I don't have the fence yet. Got a $180 bounty. I'm gonna have to start selling my body. Oh, replace deer? Oh. Hmm. I'll come back for you. You stay put now. <laughs> it's kind of fucked up. A oh. Okay, so there's a little carcass marker. Ooh, a dynamic event. I don't want to miss that. What do we got? Oh, this is where the drunk guy... I didn't upload this, but I helped that drunk guy not fall off the train. What's, uh, what we got? Hi, Pooch! Hi, little Pooch! Hey, boy. What we got? Yeah, do you smoke, sir? Sure, sure. <laughs> perhaps not as much as you. Oh, <laughs> no, no, don't worry about these. Actually, we'll take some. Take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. What are all the cigarettes for? Are you heading on a long journey or something? <laughs> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. Okay. The cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah. Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. Oh my God. A picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Is this guy okay. on something? Yeah. Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I wish I could explain to you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. Well, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the amount of money. <laughs> A veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A fortune? Any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Oh my god, is that Dutch? Circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. I did say we need money. Meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah. But you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. You'd pay me. A fair price. Now you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Rampart. At your service. So I need to spend yeah, all of my this money my train. Look on up, okay? cigarettes about this deal. so Only that I can complete set. That's where the value lies. Potentially complete a set to send to this guy. Huh. 
So I need to start collecting cigarette cards. Can I rob this train? Bro, your girl needs money. I know this is just gonna make my bounty worse. What am I gonna get from this, really, though? Is there anything valuable on this train? There's, like, people. Do I just rob all of them? Whee! I don't know. That was a rash decision. I need to think this through. We need to think about how to make money more rationally. I can't just jump on a train and start killing people. We need to think through our crimes and how we can pay off our bounty debt. Eh. Yeah. First things first, let's get back to camp, okay? Before I make any other crazy decisions. Let's, uh, let's be rational here. <laughs> kind of. What about this guy? You, get, you look robbable. Focus, 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 Aurelia. We need to start smoking cigarettes and start robbing trains. All right. Hello. God, I'm so poor! It hurts! Hi there, Arthur. Hello. Hi there. Are you being Very ready? good. We were getting low. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Have some stew. Hello, good sir. Hello, Uncle. There we go. Yummy. Just throw that shit on the ground, yep. Okay. Now let's go. Grab that other deer carcass. Come on, Is it gonna just like despawn? Cause I don't see it anymore. Hmm. I can probably just kill another deer, right? Yep. Idiot. Yeah. Okay. We don't have the fence yet. What do we have? We can try to unlock the fence. And we have a treasure map. Which is a potential source we can use to try to find the next treasure. And we have that gold bar that we salvaged from this fire area. That being said, though, what do I do with that gold bar? I'm pretty sure I need to sell it to, like, the fence, right? So all roads lead back to the fence. Ah! I think. Right? Hmm. Here's an idea. We will go on the treasure hunt. For the next part of that puzzle. And then I'll try to unlock the fence. Oh wait, we can only carry one thing at a time, right?
cook. Right here, right now? Okay. That should do us. Yep. Gosh, this game is so pretty. Let's go back to camp and drop this guy off and then get ourselves a good night's rest. Oh? Uh Oh, hey sir, could you help me? My horse ran away. I see it. Do I need a lasso? Gotcha. Come on! Come on, on Worsi! Not a girl. Or boy. Or whatever you are. Little horsey. You can be whatever you want to be. What? I'm never gonna be a nice person ever again in my life. Fuck this whole game. What is this possibly gonna say? And a nice fellow taking photos of animals, Albert Mason, I think he was called. Kind and interesting and entirely lost and unused to real country, even though he seemed to love it. Trying to take pictures of all our biggest predators before they all got themselves killed by a modern world. Should have got him to take a picture of Dutch. He got robbed by a coyote, but I, or a coyote, but I got his bait back. This fella I took with him at the train station told me I'd get decent money if I collected complete sets of cigarette cards and send them to him. We shall see. Sounds harmless enough. Bruh. What the heck? Did I really accidentally run this guy over? Oh, there you are. Sure. It was him. He had it all the time. Mr. Miller, he'll never let you down. So what you're saying is I went to go hunt a creature for the camp for the stew. I went out of my way to go get meat for the stew. What ended up happening was we encountered a stranger on the side of the road whose horse ran away. I'm like, okay, sure, sure, no problem. I'll help you. Get my lasso, chase after the horse, right down the road, lasso that son of a gun, bring it all the way back to the stranger, and I'm like, here, here you go, here's your horse. I accidentally run the guy over, become dishonorable, and have accidentally led an enemy to camp, and pass out, and wake up, the next day. All because I wanted to go grab some meat for camp and I wanted to help a stranger. So, so mor moral of the story is never bring meat to camp or help strangers. Is that what I'm hearing? I've got to work thrice as hard to... <laughs> Be a good person because of the accidental bad deeds I do. Like... 
What? Gonna do my daily chores to try to restore my honor. My God. Any other chores I can do to try to be a better person? This guy looks crazy. Ugh. What time is it? He is crazy. Okay. Cool. Well, now that that's over and done. Need some beans. And uh, let's see what we can do here. We're still a wanted man. We still need to do this Hosea mission, probably to unlock the fence, right? And let's take a look at this next treasure hunt we've got going on. Mate! Uncle? Hitting on Susan? So yes. Okay. Well, if I'm gonna go out with you, I'm gonna have to look my best. So can I borrow ten dollars? Can I borrow a few dollars? I'm good for it. Bruh. Borrow money? Oh, you horrible man. I thought we were on to something. God damn it, Uncle. <sighs> what an idiot. Okay. Anyways. Uh... This will continue at a later time. Hmm. Treasure Hunter, is this one? Second map in the next part of the treasure's trail is found. Use the map to search for the treasure. Okay, so yeah, we did this little number here with finding the treasure on Caliban's... The titty... What is it called? Wiener Mountain? Now the question is, how do we move on to the next thing? It was like right here, right? Maybe, or somewhere in this region. How do we find the next objective? Is there like a... Uh, there's an inventory, right? Yeah, B for bag. Chick's treasure map, Jack Hall gang map two. We got a couple maps. Okay, so we did map one. Let's look at map two. Oh yes, this was the thing. There's some geysers, geysers, three and a sun. Oh god. Three geysers and a sun. I've not seen the geyser in this game yet. Is there anything on the back? Oh god. Geysers, geysers. How do you pronounce that word? Geyser. 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 We'll go with that. I'd buy it. Okay. So, we're on the hunt for that. And then, what is this chick's map to? Or chick's treasure map? 
If something should happen to me or my possessions are stored here. Oh, I've already got that guy. Okay, I've done this one, so. Geysers. How are you? How are you? Good. Hmm. I'm all right. Good for you. I honestly wouldn't even know where to start with that. I haven't seen a single geyser. Hmm. Have we unlocked it yet? That area? Hmm. I don't think I have. That being said... Hmm. I would have known that area if I've seen it, I feel like, because that seems pretty obvious, like, a geyser. That being said, let's go straight to the Hosea mission then, since I don't know exactly where that next thing is going to be. Um, I think it'll, it'll really hit me. I'll be like, oh my god, geysers. I know exactly what this is. Let's just keep rolling with the natural flow. Kind of how I feel a lot of things in this game are going to be. Ooh, I'm dirty also. Hey, all good out here? Use a bath here shortly. Excuse me. Also, one more mystery is on my mind. It's the murder mystery. Can I open my bag? Okay, I can. Where is the... Oh, was that under journal or something? Not journal. Logs. Heck! Treasure hunter. We'll get back to that. Watson's cabin is the lady who has valuables. We can do that another time. Whenever we can go back to Strawberry. And then... Where's the murder stuff? Dinosaur bones. Cigarette cards. Treasure hunter. Huh. Hmm. Yep. I don't really remember. I thought it was a note that we found with the hanged man's ridge thing with like the, like the, the bridge over it and then the three dead bodies or whatever. What we got going on over here? I think maybe we see uh, last time was luck, huh? Oh, this guy! Remember last time I did this, I didn't realize we could use Deadeye? I don't have my... Today, what do you say about the ante this I don't have my... Make it interesting. Gun. Okay, carbine repeater. Sure, ten dollars. I'm feeling good Fuck. too. Ha! Okay, my friend, let's do it. Just like the last time, okay? Who can shoot the most bottles? Just draw your gun and aim when you're ready. All right? <laughs> shoot! Perfecto. Maldito. You just got lucky. Ten dollars. Let's make some money. If that makes you feel better. Oh God. Sure. Oh, that was damn pathetic. How about another round, huh? Race stakes. Fuck! Twenty dollars? Oh my god, this hurts. Okay, uh -huh. That's a we're doing good it. Call, amigo. All right, real simple. First one to hit four birds wins. Stand near me, and as soon as they come out, it's anyone's shot. Fuck. Be patient. Four. Ah, there they go. Shoot. Get your gun out! You idiot! 
Why could I not get my gun out? Dude. Oh my fucking god. Good shooting. <gasps> ah, here it is. Oh my god, twenty dollars is twenty dollars. Appreciate it. God bless us. Sure. <sighs> Better watch on next time. You'll see. Hoo-wee! Well, that was a way to make some money. Let's keep going. What the heck? Yeah. I like that guy. He's a nice guy. Please don't shoot me. Morning, mister. Hello, you don't know. I'm a $180 criminal. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. <clears throat> These guys don't know me. They don't know my life. They don't know what I've been through. Another random activity. <laughs> this game is so dynamic, I can't. What am I supposed to do with this? Are we going to the smokestack? What do we got here? Oh my gosh. What do we got here? The name's William. Hello. Arthur, you familiar with the study of plants, my friend? Familiar ain't quite the word I'd use. Well, let me tell you. This great earth beneath our feet can provide everything man ever needs. But we've only reached a tiny bit of its potential. You see, there are thousands, maybe millions of plants all across this vast country we share. The mountains, the plains, the swamps, I mean to explore them all, to know all of nature's bounty and all of her wonder, if I can. Sure. But I'm only one man. Would you consider helping me with gathering herbs for my studies? Oh my gosh. Why? Knowledge. <laughs> kindness. Why? Beauty. My I'm man, ugly. Arthur. Ignorant. Ugly. And nasty. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see if maybe we can do something about that. I'll see. Huh. Okay. I'm looking for a plant called yarrow. I thought I have you can some yarrow. It by its red flowers. It shouldn't be too hard to find. They thrive out in the open under direct sunlight. Do I have yarrow? Take my plants. <laughs> Let's see how this tastes. Watch him die. Oh, yeah. I feel better already. They were right. This stuff does have medicinal properties. Huh. Already, eh? Uh. You've been helpful. Thank you. You're a horseman, I know. You'll want to have this on hand. A remedy? Save it for bad injuries. Horse reviver? If horse is in trouble, you'll be glad you had it. Now, oh you my mind, I'll be getting back God. To my I look forward to our next meeting, traveler. This guy's the goat. Thank you. I can see why you do this. All the best to you. Thanks, Arthur. A and to you. My God, this guy's our new best friend. I'm so glad I did that. Well, that's incredible. Let's go, girl. I did not know what I was expecting, but that was lit. Dude. He just gave us some free horse survivor. This guy is awesome. What a lad. I've got a hair on my nose and it's bothering me. I keep trying to acquire it. 
I mean, I know there's hair all over my face, haha, but like, it's out of place. Wow. We made 20 bucks, we got the free horse survivor. This day is looking up. All we did was murder an entire village of people and amass a nearly $200 bounty on our heads. C'est la vie. Excusez-moi. Извините меня. Stay back. Here's official business. Jesus, anyone? Help! Big mistake, pal. Well. Hey, will you get me off this horse? Oh my God. Accidentally Please. killing people. I can't take this horse much longer. <laughs> it's getting hard to breathe in these ropes here. Bruh, give me a second. Uh, you're after me too. I know it. I know it. Jesus Lord. But. Who is this guy? Yeah. Does he need to die? Is done. I'll Carry on. Yeah. <laughs> Thought I uh, saved him. Anyways, someone will come for him. It's fine. Don't worry about him. <laughs> He's got people. It's fine. Horsey. A good horse. All right, Jose, I'm here for mischief and mayhem. What you got for me, brother? An interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. It's trusting. I don't do so well. Please. Hi, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes this. Liking ain't the problem. Oh? Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't want my boss hearing. This is a sideline. 
course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? <laughs> to this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business. Bro, dealings. Arthur, Listen, shut up. He's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. Steal a stagecoach? Take out your competition. Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, what? but a cousin by marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now you survive that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. Hmm. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But money. You're fine with us robbing your cousin. You say we got marriage. money? Money, yes, honey? I love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. Okay. Our marriage. <laughs> I'm interested. First, you had my interest. Now you have. First, you had my attention, and now you have my interest. I am very interested. I was not interested in robbery for sport, but for really? for business. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? Neither I don't rob for pleasure. I rob for sport. That's what you call it. Oh, clearly you've recovered from your bear. Hi, pooch. Your little poochums. Let's fucking go, y'all. We get some money. Better, couldn't you? Get a new business partner. You wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Jose. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches, that's easy money for us. Damn it. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus' old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. So what's the story with that Emerald Ranch? You find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Seamus is sure scared of him. That's not saying much. Something strange about the place. Used to be a saloon there, general store. Now it's all closed up, but they seem to have money. Sounds worth a look around. For sure. Seamus also mentioned the rancher's daughter a couple of times. How he used to see her around all the time, but now she never leaves the house. Probably just sweet on her. Mm. That what you call finding out a little? Once he opens up, seems Seamus does like to talk. Hopefully not too much. Yep. Stagecoach and some money, eh? That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. All right, let's go, baby. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. All right, I see nothing that could go wrong, right? Right? I'm a professional. Wait, let me... All right. Okay. Ooh, pop the shoulders. Stagecoach has to be in there. Take a sippy sip of my coffee. What could possibly go wrong? Okay. Let's take a quick look at the place. <laughs> mm. Anyone around? Yes. Okay. I reckon we can do it now. Mm -hmm. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? I prefer night, because I am clumsy. 
Just wait. I don't think conducting business operations during the daytime. Uh, these kinds of business operations are a really good idea. Okay, let's go. We know go the most heinous of crimes are committed in the nighttime. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. Rock me, mama, like a rag and wheel. Rock me, mama, any way you feel. Hey, mama, rock me. Rock me, mama, like the wind and the rain. Rock me, mama, like a southbound train. Hey, maybe take a peek through the windows mama, before you go rock in. Me. Make sure it's all quiet. a nice little country house. It'd be a shame if someone robbed the shit out of it. Hmm. All right. Are you here crying? That's a human. This is probably not the best room to rob. Oh my god, what the fuck? Just close all these fucking drawers! Hurry up! What are we doing? their pearl necklace in a their necklace is in a chest right next to the front door of their house carrot these are for the horses anything in here people always leave shit in their chimney right it's a thing in this game Hundred fifty dollars. Oh my fucking god. Oh no, I'm greedy. We're going upstairs too, bitch. Oh my god. Oh, I don't care. Shh. Threaten. Leave that son of a bitch alone. We're robbing him. Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Can I put out the fire in the chimney and check it? Can I steal his bourbon? Ah, I've got too much of it. All right, all right. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Good job. What, what was that? Was that just the chest? Yeah, it was. Okay, let's get out of here. Get on, dear boy. Oh my god, he's got the... 186 doll hairs. I'm trying. How do I... Just waiting on you, Arthur. I'm working on it, sir. How do I... What are you playing? Just get on the... I'm trying! Can 
Oh, okay. I just had to press the get on horse button. That's easy. All right, let's go. Whee! Yeah! Committing crime and not doing any time. Am I right, brother? Yeehaw! We robbed the shit out of that house. That felt good. Excuse me! And I'm pretty sure they never even knew I was there. Best way. Less problems the better right now. Let's fucking go. Do I get to keep that money? Can I pay off my bail? I'm a good boy! Found some money stashed away. Must be a few hundred, not too bad. Not bad at all. Slow it down a bit. No. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. No doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. True. Retelling of that one around the campfire. It wasn't the first time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye, and as usual, he did not flinch. No. How long you think we're gonna stick around here for? Not sure. Till we can't, I suppose. Feels like we're starting to get back on our feet, slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. Jinky, what are you doing, your baby? Come on! I'm Pick working up the on it. Bruh. Rock me, my Hello, life. Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? The you feel. Fine. Nice people. <clears throat> Park that thing in here. Quickly. Back that ass up. Hey, little cutie, won't you back that ass up? Hell yeah, brother. Nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. Sure. Let's go. We did it. Seamless committing of crimes. I do say so myself. Very nice. That was exciting. Robbed a house. Hopefully unlocked the fence now. $300? Let's go. You can sell stolen wagons to Shamus. Shamus? Seamus? Shamus. Zero suit Shamus? <laughs> Definitely not a sexy but Gets the job done. Um, <laughs> that being said, we can pay off our bounty. Hell yeah, brother. Hi, and all that. Hi, uncle. Uncle. And we might even have some money to give back to the camp. But first, I need to pay off my heckin' debt. I'm gonna go to bed. And by debt, I mean my bail. I'm gonna go to sleep. Wake up. And do my chores, and then go pay my bail, and then, or my bounty, rather. And then I'm gonna take a bath, and then we're gonna go rob the little old lady that lives in the cabin in Strawberry. <laughs> that is currently the plan. Also is, ooh, but first, maybe I can stop by Emerald Ranch and see if I can use the fence? this flower? What is this? Where did I get a flower from? Alright. We, we're in good need of a bath and a haircut. Am I right? Yarrow. Jose and I went robbing just like the old days. A father and son pair of clowns at some farmhouse. 
stole a wagon, sold it to some rat Jose I had met at an odd place called Emerald Ranch. What goes on there, I cannot tell, but this little purchaser of stolen goods had us go rob his own family. Even by my standards, that was low, but the father and son we robbed was proof that even God makes mistakes sometimes. I snuck in at night and we robbed the loathsome bastards blind. Hell yeah. Good morning, Arthur. Good morning, Dutch. Hey okay there, Dutch. Yeah. When are you going to meet Trelawney and the others? If there's a chance to get to Sean. I know, I know. I'm on it, I promise. Ooh, what is that for again? Have I heard of that yet? Mister? Morning. Alright. Look at those god rays. Oof. What a beautiful morning it is on the camp. Let's get our chores done right quick so we can uh get to crime. This game is starting to make a lot more sense now. I feel like it has more meaning. Because at first I was like, what the hell is going on, dude? Like, it's open world. I just keep getting approached by women getting kidnapped on horseback or like random people asking for dinosaur bones. And then like there's these people in this camp. Like, it was overwhelming, but now I'm starting to feel like I'm in my groove. Like, it, I feel a lot better when I have a checklist. Just in general, as a gamer, I like having things that I can mark off and I know what direction I'm heading in because if there's just too many things, I get overwhelmed and I just want to put the game down. So, I'm really glad that it's like, okay, wake up. Always the same people doing all the work. Sure is, Susan. Uh, get my chores done. Talk to people around the camp. I've got like my crimes to commit. My missions to do. It just it feels like a lot more fulfilling when I feel like I'm working towards Something. I don't know how you guys are as gamers, but. Alright, let's chop some wood real quick. And then we'll go to Emerald Ranch. Try to use the fence. Try to sell our goods. And then go pay our bail. Our bounty. And rob people. And maybe take a bath. Because <laughs> I think we're surrounded by fleas again. And we're looking a little skinny too. Oh, yeah. Very nice. You're stalking me too, Arthur. You're getting crazy, Dutch. I've always been crazy, Arthur. You know that. Why are you so obsessed with me, Dutch? I want to know. Biscuits. Alright, princess, you look like you need some food, too. There you go. After today's heist, we deserve a nice sit-down at the bar with a proper meal. Nice proper meal and maybe some whiskey. Can I climb? The waves of the bay of the biscuit. I began to tumble and roar. Hello, are you interacting with me, son? The face was as red as a lobster. I fell and broke my poor knobster. 
I need some coffee. If Swanson's gonna... Oh my god. Swanson! Oh my god. My god, I just need a cup of coffee. Hi, buddy. And good morning. Stay calm. Jack needs you calm. Could use a slug of whiskey in this. Huh? Maybe after lunch, hey? You ain't giving up on us, are you? No, of course not. But this is no situation for Abigail and the boy. How do you mean? It's gonna be all right. You really think so? Hmm. Morale is low in the camp. You know. Hmm. Good talk, Dutch. Mor okay. Goodbye. Morale is low. Vibes are not high in the camp. Um. Let's see if I can do this jazz. What other main missions do I have going on? I had to free Micah from jail, but I honestly have lost track. I have no clue what I'm supposed to be uh, doing. We got the guy who's like literally dying of some sort of cancer or something. We yelled at him and his family. That was a main mission for uh, one of our guys. We did the Hosea thing. We bailed Micah out of jail. Honestly, I'm not tracking, like, what... I guess we need to go visit Micah, because he said... I'll come back and repay the favor, so maybe we can go say hi to Micah. See what he's got for us. I'm not tracking if that's a main mission, though, or if that's just, like, a... side thing we can do in our free time. Don't know. It's nice that we can sell our carriages, though. I'm not always just, like, robbing random carriages, but when there is an opportunity and, like, someone's being smuggled or they're, like, in trouble and I shoot the guys that are on the carriage, that's a good opportunity to take it and sell it, like... to see when I can figure out how to fast travel though because this is kind of a commute all right I'm so excited I wonder if this has been unlocked officially I saw a little circle marker here oh shit is that it morning that little icon Ooh, I'm excited. Okay, let's see, let's see. God, this game is so pretty. I love all the aminals! Oh, and I hear a train. Hi there, mister. Ah, I recognize that face. Mm-hmm. Hi! This old Bob Crawford was livid about his coach getting robbed. 
<laughs> I was very sympathetic. You are. Can I rob that train? Oh my god, we can sell all of our shit. Oh my god, I've got so much shit. Jewelry bag, gold nugget. Bracelet. Earrings. Gold bar. Pocket watch. Bands. Oh my god. Rings. Here, let me just move. <laughs> they call me Moneybag McGee, baby. Hell yeah. We can buy us a, no, a whole house. Fuck yeah, dude. We're crushing this game, bro. That was so worth. Holy shit. Oh my god, it's still racking up. Over a thousand smackaronis? What does this guy sell? Bye. Arms. Stay safe and quiet now. Everything's locked. Machete for cutting down anyone that gets in the way. High roller. Some beans. Kit. Snake oil. Masks. Ooh. Psycho mask. Craft tomahawk, poison arrows, special bitters. My god. Thousand dollars? Can I rob this train? Okay, we have a thousand dollars. I don't need to rob this train. <laughs> My inner chaos gremlins like, train? We're good, we're good. We got money. But it's a train! Does this train happen to pass by Strawberry, you reckon? I just need to hitch a ride. Catch a ride! Let me just start. Uh, I caught the Yes, 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 yes. If I pull the trajectory of this railroad track and it seems to go down to the south and then a little bit off to the west, there is a station up ahead that we can jump off on to pay our bounty, it seems. Flat neck station. Hmm. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cruise. A thousand doll hairs, man. That's wild. That's a dead animal, oh my god. Oh, my horse is just following? That's kind of cute. Also not suspicious at all. God damn it, princess. Dude, that's a dead moose, poor thing. Princess! What are you doing? Is she just gonna... This could go terribly, terribly wrong. What if we go off a bridge? Oh god, princess! <gasps> oh, thank god. Oh my god, I thought she was gonna get run over by the train. I would... I would have committed Sudoku in game. Jesus Christ. That was an emotional moment for me. Ah! Jesus. I just need to get to the station. Hello. Don't mind me. Ow. Hey, that. Stop. Oh, Can't see here. fuck. That's a guy. Bruh! Fuck this 
this game, yo! Arthur Morgan, God! My knees! Fuck, man! Can a guy just get, catch a ride? Oh my god, the militia's here! Where's Princess? Moonshine! Take me now! Fuck me, dude! The entire Oh my god, my heart rate! I think I just pooped my pants! Bro, what? <gasps> Y'all know my biggest fear in games is water and water animals! Dude, are you shitting me? Oh my god, what am I supposed to do? I'm so upset. I just said do uh with like three syllables. Do uh Dude, what the fuck am I I am being chomped on by a gator and I've got three sheriffs on the coast waiting for my ass. Do uh Fuck. Okay. Think fast. Think fast, Morgan. Don't punch the croc. Shoot the croc. Motherfucker. 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 Drink some moonshine. All right. We got this, bitch. We got this. Potent healthcare. Suck my dick. Run. Go ahead. Fuck. New journal entry. Oh my god! I'm in a swamp! Oh my god, thank god Princess is here. Dude, I feel like I'm having a stroke. What? I'm in the bayou. What on God's green earth? I'm like shaking! <sighs> what in the world? Dude, what in the world? There's a swamp? Oh my god, I need a minute. I'm literally... I'm like... tweaking right now. Jesus Christ, okay. What? What? Where am I wanted at? Can I check that somewhere? Can I see, like, my status? Yep. I have eight dollars? No, eight, sixteen. Bullets! Oh my god! Where am I going? I just need to get to a post office, bro. Where am I? I guess I'm just gonna keep traveling south. We're just gonna go down. We're just gonna go down. Achoo! Excuse me. No. Oh. oh my gosh. I'm okay. <clears throat> Save my sip my little coffee. Everything's fine. <clears throat> I'm fine. No one told me Red Dead Redemption was a horror game. What is going on? <clears throat> I just need to find a post office so I can pay my bounty. That's all I want. Okay. Okay. 
Gonna unclear that. <clears throat> We're just gonna keep going down. I see some friendly looking houses. All right, don't want to cross this because there's gators. Yep, there they are. Oh my god. Let me just study this right quick. <clears throat> okay. We're gonna not go straight through the water. What? What? You okay, mister? What? Please. I've been bitten by a snake. Another snake bite person. I need medicine. Here. You'll help. The last guy we helped gave us a free gun. Is that medicine? Oh, oh, oh thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. I owe you one, mister. Got that right. Hopefully, I could repay you someday. Okay. I gotta get out of here. <clears throat> okay. Supposedly, we can head uh, out towards the west, because that's where we need to go anyways, to go towards Strawberry. Just uh, follow this here road. <clears throat> With the weird red mist. Hello. Why is it all weird? Just like crops? God, this is so pretty! Look at that! What the fuck? It's like a farm! Whoa! More gang violence? What's going on? The guards? Dude, look at that ranch! Oh my god! What is that city down there? First of all, look at this plantation estate ranch thing. Second of all, what is that in the horizon? Dude, what? I'm going wherever that is. Is that an actual city? I saw factory smoke. Wait, what? Ah! Hundred and five? What? Why is my bounty a hundred and five here? Because I stepped foot in their property, or is it because of that whole sheriff debacle I just had with the gators? With the with the train. Hundred and five. Jesus Christ, what did I do? Is this a station? This looks Quite abandoned. Is there goodies here? What are the odds I'm gonna get bitten by something or die? Or both? I'm gonna get tetanus out here. Any, uh... Gold bars lying around. Hmm. Nothing. Oh, 
Oh my god. Look at the mini map. There's red. Is that where I'm wanted? Bro, I just got to this new area of the map. And I'm a degenerate? I haven't even stepped foot in this area. What's a gator? Fuck me, dude. Are these just like hanging out? Dear God, it's a baby gator! Jesus Christ! Okay, girl. Oh, I hate this. Stinky water animals are stinky. Okay. Let's just go down these train tracks. Into the red zone. What's the worst that could happen? A legendary fish location? Ooh, I don't even think I know how to fish yet. That's kind of fun. 105 bounty, yep. Is that a police officer? Please don't arrest me. Dude, this is actually so cool. It's actually like a town. I'm about to get shot. I just need to get to your nearest, like, station. Station? Freight station? Please. Oh, please. This is so cool. I really want to take more of it in, but I am afraid for my life right now. Stables. Oh my gosh! Bounty poster, probably mine. Show. Post office, post office, post office, post office, post office. Post office. Oh my gosh, this is so cool! This is so cool! I am not going the right way, but it's fine. I feel like I'm in, like, Louisiana or something. The bayou and then the architecture and vibes is giving me New Orleans vibes. Yeah, and the music? Oh my gosh, this is so cool! What? Oh my gosh, this is... Okay. Please. I'll be with you in just a moment. I just need to pay all of my bounties. Uh, hello. hello sir. What do you need? Please. That's quite a sum. I hope you learned your lesson. Woo! Deep pockets. <sighs> Good night for a better day. Well, that's done. I'm reformed. Never committing crime again. Dude. We got $800 now? Wait. Who's gone missing? What are they talking about? Hello, mister. Hey there, mister. Dude, this is the coolest place I've been to. Rob this guy. Hello. It's so alive. It's bustling. Spaulding's is this like a store? The majestic tailors. I want to see what kind of fashion they have here. Is this actually a... It doesn't look actionable. Okay. I also want to give Arthur a bath. A trapper. A fence. A general store. Ooh, a photo studio. A barber. A tailor. Oh my god. Okay. Stay the gunsmith. All right, we're gonna go. We're gonna just be on our merry way. We're gonna go to the gunsmith. Is there a pub? 
you guys see a bar? Show? Saloon. Oh, it probably opens later at night. So by the time we're done shopping, it should be open. <clears throat> All right. We're going to check out the gunsmith. Excuse me. So cool. Just random back alleys and stuff. Oop. Eh. Excuse me. Gunsmith. Hello? Forty dollars? Oh fuck no! I think you have me mistaken, sir. Motherfucker! Nothing goes right for me. Fuck you, dude. Give me my damn money. And then some. Come on, this ain't fair. Yeah, it is. You robbed me, motherfucker. Fair. I'll show you fair. Catch these hands. What the hell? I've shot people for coughing at me. You think I won't tie you up for robbing me? I've killed people for looking at me funny. Anyways. Now, let's have a look. <sighs> let's see what we got. We got a pretty good revolver. We have the volcano one, so I don't think we're in need of that. Yeah, we got the volcanic pistol. Got the carbine repeater. Looks like we can't really buy anything better than that right now. I wonder if I can uh upgrade some of the finest quality guns in the south. Bandolier. Increases capacity for repeater rifle and shotgun ammo by 50% permanently? Slows degradation for all weapons by 10%. These are pretty good. Revolver and pistol by 50%. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Oh, you don't mess around. I'm gonna buy a couple of these guys, and we're gonna buy ammo. Alright. We're at $750. I need to clean out my weapons Please, too. Keep looking. What did I just... What is that? Did I just put bait out on the ground? What the fuck? Looks like I just took a dump in the middle of this guy's establishment. Whoops. I just took a dumpy in this guy's shop. My bad, go. My bad, dude. Exploring around a shop where getting a tip from a stranger may expose a shop's unusual activities. Ah, huh. was this guy saying that? Hi, folks. Hello, sir. Oh, hello. This guy runs an illicit Real business. Beautiful country around this area. Oh. Gentlemen, what's new? How do you do, sir? Hmm. Neoma. I don't 
don't trust people around these parts. I got robbed! With my first, like, ten minutes here. You can rob any shop by aiming your gun at the clerk. Oh! That's nice. My gosh, this is so pretty! I wanted to go to the tailor. Mm, around here and to the left. And... I wanted to go to... The bar. And barber. Hello there. This is so cool! Brewery. Heck yeah! I also would like to groom our horse, because it's looking rough. Should I grow out the hair? Get it in a little ponytail? Stylish and clean. Bald. All right, so everything's at zero but our stash. Looking good. Hmm. I say you look ready for a portrait now. I'm trying to just uh, grow out our handlebar right now. All Heck right. yeah. You ready to go? All right. You know where God, princess is so All dirty. Right, Oops, excuse me. Sorry. Be. All right, I needed to go to the tailor, and I need to give Princess some love. Let's see what outfits we got. Oh, a question mark up there too. How you doing, friend? Hello. Can I climb this wall? There's a question mark up there. I'm well, thank you. Excuse me. Right. See. What? Hello. What? Hello. How are you today? Let me vote. Let me vote. Let me vote. Jesus. Hello. Come on in. Just bust in there. Now, let me have a look. Let's see. We're at $748. So we're not doing too bad. The St. Dennis. Ooh. Oh. That is a local favorite. Oh. Huh. Oh, my man, if I had a dollar for every time somebody said to me, haven't I met you somewhere else? <laughs> Huh. I don't know how I feel about these outfits. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I take pride in my selection here. Everything here is of exceptional quality. I don't really like it. Sorry. Can I buy one of the dresses? Bonjour. Bonjour. 
Excuse me. Sorry. Bonjour. What's this question mark we got going up? in your heart to give to those who gave everything. Your donation will greatly improve the lives of our nation's heroes and their loved ones. Hello. Excuse me, sir. Can I bother you for a minute of your time? Sure. All right. Can I tell you a little about what we're doing here? Sure. Less than a minute, I promise. Monsieur, uh, we're trying to raise money to build an expansion to the Quincy Harris Memorial Hall, a shelter for homeless veterans and their families. Can you help? A donation of $20 would put us well on our way. Sure. Twenty dollars ain't no chicken feed, but sure, I can help you out. That's very kind. What is your name, sir? Arthur Morgan. Your donation will Loot. be acknowledged on a founder's plaque when the building is completed. You have a great day, Mr. Morgan. Loot the box with all the donations in it? Kind of hacks, to be honest. Come on, girl. Steal all the money they've been raising. Um. All right, I need to go to the stables now. Dude, this place is so cool. Look at all this life, all these homes. I'm gonna take this way down. Just because I want to see the views. Oh my gosh. Wow. These are some houses. Holy heck. Wow. This is badass. move camps we've got to move camps right because people in the camp are like this is only temporary this ain't for forever and stuff like that so i wonder if we ever relocate to like the bayou or whatever i have no idea what's to come but surely we don't just stay there the whole game uh can i just take care of my horse is there a way to just like clean it yep we can pick that up. Upgrade. Hmm. You can't have too much with you out in the wilderness. I don't really want to upgrade anything. She looks good as she is, honestly. Bye for now. You and that horse are always oh. well. She's clean now. That worked. Oh my gosh, look at the water! This is so cool! Wow. Honestly, if I'm here, I might as well just buy a train ticket, right? There's no point in me riding all the way down there. I can just hitch a train to, uh... You have a problem? No. To wherever I'm going. Um... Where's our buddy Micah at now? Hmm. It said, like, pay him a visit. No, 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 not journal. Heck. Oops. Hmm. Break him out of jail. Oh, replay. Huh. Evening to you. Hello. Hmm. The train station was like somewhere nearby.
Now don't go busting through these doors, Arthur. Jesus. I know you like to make a scene. Evening. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Alright. If you would give me a minute, please. Evening. Train tickets. Hmm. Valentine, Wallace Station. Ooh. What's the closest to Strawberry? There was like a Rhodes and some other stuff. Let's see. Riggs? Can I travel to Riggs? Or Wallace, potentially? Those might be. Good evening, mister. I don't remember if I saw those. There's no rigs, but there. Oh, yes, there is. Rigs! Let's do it! Oh, yeah, it's train time! Just vibing out in the country with my homies. How cozy. Is this what it's like actually paying for a train and not just robbing one? Feels so bougie. Get out of here right now. Come this way. What did I just walk in on? All right. Just be on my way. That being said, ooh, there's a bounty poster here, and there was one in uh, Saint Denis, Denny, whatever, as well. But hmm, taxidermist home. Is this the- where is this cabin? I know I need to go out here for Shersies somewhere, but I want to rob this lady. The lady with the goods, as they- as it were. Mm -hmm. Watson's cabin. Old lady who lives north of Strawberry. It's probably that thing I hovered over, yeah? This little guy, right? Strawberry. That looks like a little square north of Strawberry. Or this taxidermist house. We'll just head in this general direction and see where it leads us. Let's see uh, what we got going on. Okay, can't jump through the train. I haven't had a bath in days. I was meaning to hit up a bar. Like a hotel or something, but... What was that sound? Was that a moose? Oh my god. That was brutal. Alright, before we head up for this robbery, let's see if we've got a... Called a hotel. Can I go in? Nasty piece of work that one, it, man. Really? That's a no. Hmm. Yep. Nowhere to have a bath, eh?
cabin north of the woods. Is this it? I mean... Maybe, maybe not? I don't think so. I don't see the fence around it. And the other one had like a donkey and a fence. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Let's, uh... Try our luck. Up here? We said north of the town. Yeah. Let's go this way. Let's see what we got. That's a grave site. Hmm. This is treacherous. Yeah. Where the heck am I going? Uh, I don't think this is the cabin, but... Whoa, whoa, whoa. We made it this far, so... My God. <gasps> Is that dinosaur bones? Hold up, wait a minute. No shit. We actually found some of the dinosaur bones? Massive skeleton. Wonder how big the man was. Or if it was a man at all. What? Giant remains? What the fork? Yep. Ah! <gasps> oh, it's cold. I'm cold. Huh. This is really pretty. Anyways, where's this grandma we're supposed to rob? Yep. Uh, 
Oh my freaking heck. Run, 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 run. Holy heck. Oh my god. Where am I? There are so many predators. Hello! Hey there, fella. Where am I? Jesus! Let's go up this way and see what there is. Since I'm already out here, Alt West. these horrifying sounds Shit. Shit. Hey, this here's a private financial matter, so why don't you keep right along? Not looking to interfere with any sensitive financial matters, I'll leave you to it. We said to scram. I lied. Well, let's see if this safe is worth the effort. Whoa. Get out of my way. Oh my god, his head is gone. Go over there. I don't want you, I just want your safe. Hmm. Hmm. I need, like, dynamite? Thing away, Arthur. What we got? Twenty dollars and twenty more dollars. Oh, Forty buck action is worth two lives. We're all right. Quinn says, "My baby girl." Oh, girl. Let's go. She's my partner in crime. My little baby girl. Oh, they're wild pigs. I was like, what are these awful, god awful sounds? Mm, I don't have a winter outfit. Oh my god, I'm soaked in blood right now. But you know what? At least there's no alligators. I got that going for me. Yoo-hoo! Fine morning, partner. Sure is. Sure is. Right, can we take a bath in this lake real quick? Oh my gosh, this is so pretty! Oh my god, that fish, did I just kill it by... ...stomping on it? I think I just murdered this fish. Oh my god, Princess and I just... ...killed this fish. I don't even have the fishing skill, we just absolutely ran over it. What? 
All right. Arthur. Average. Fair temperature. Honor. What does that mean? Am I honorable or not? I'm average weight. I'm doing all right. I'm doing all right. How's our how's princess doing? Level three bonding, clean, calm. She's fit. We're doing good. I don't know what all the hubbubaloo is about. Arthur's doing just fine. We take care of our boy. Bro, this shit's so pretty. I love this game, man. Every time I play this game, it's just a new adventure. And today was no exception to that rule because we got a lot done. <laughs> we got a lot done. I always feel fulfilled when I finish playing this game. So we got the fence unlocked via a heist and robbing someone's house and stealing their carriage. We also managed to get Micah out of jail. I don't know still if that's the traditional way you're supposed to do it, but I just shot up that whole town. And then we somehow made a lot of money. <laughs> and we're able to pay that really steep bounty off. And then we got another bounty for jumping on a train and killing a guard. And then we were almost chomped by a gator. We were chomped by a gator actually and died. And we had to pay that bounty off. And then we found a really cool town. It's just like this game is so dynamic. I can't get over the fact that like every time you play, there's just stuff happening around you. I honest to God feel like I could just step away from this game and it would just play itself almost, which is a really neat experience to be able to exist in a world that's existing around you almost while you're playing this game. So it's really awesome. I'm having a really good time playing this game. It's good to be back in the saddle and I'm looking forward to seeing what adventures lie ahead. See you guys in the next episode. See ya.